Hello everyone, this is Arthur from Art Studio Lab and welcome to my new Adobe Illustrator tutorial for this week. Today's topic is to create an op art or optical art. It's a style of visual art or abstract art that uses optical illusions to create feelings of movement or vibration. It's the simple process that uses just the distort and blending tools in Illustrator, but the result is pretty cool. So let's begin by creating a new document in Adobe Illustrator. The size doesn't matter in this tutorial so you can set any amount you want. Select the ellipse tool and set the color to black with no stroke and draw the circle on the artboard. Hold the shift key while dragging to keep the proportions in check. Align and place the black circle in the center of your artboard. Select the main circle and go to Effect, choose Distort and Transform and Zigzag. Click the Smooth Point options and change the ridges into 3 and size to 5%. Then click the Relative options. To apply this into permanent shape, select the main shape you created. Then go to Object and Expand Appearance. Make a copy of this shape, so go to Edit copy and then paste in place. Hold the shift and alt key while dragging down to decrease the size of the first shape in front to make a small version of it in the center. Select all the shapes you created, then go to object, blend and make. And now, you have blending objects already. Go to effect, pathfinder and exclude to punch out the blending shapes. Select all the shapes then double click on blend tool. Change the spacing into specified steps then change its number to any amount you want. Select all the shapes again and click on isolate selected objects. Then just click on the middle shape, go to Effect, and select Distort and Transform, Transform. Then you can now change its angle to 100%, and click OK. You can try to move the middle shape to anywhere you want it to be. Double click the blank space anywhere outside of the artboard to exit from the isolated shape. Press Ctrl or Command A to select all, and then go to Object and select Expand Appearance. Increase the size of the shape, then select the Rectangle tool. Position the rectangle in the center of the artboard, then press Ctrl or Command A to select All, then right click and choose Make Clipping Mask. The final result is a cool optical art that gives an impression that it seems to be moving. Ideal for visual art, optical illusion art, or just for fun. So, if you enjoy this new tutorial in Adobe Illustrator, then give thumbs up for this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you will not miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one.